Welcome up? everyone. This is uh, Blitzbreaker Any Percent. With me on the couch is Milk and Marlexa. Welcome to Square. Uh, That's me. I'm just gonna go to extra menu here and reset. Gonna do that for every Any Percent attempt. And yeah, give me a countdown and we'll be good to go. Right. Three, two, two, one, one go. All right, there we go. This is Blitzbreaker. Uh, there's really not that much to it to this game. You can press left, right, up, and down. And uh, yeah, if you press left, you go left until you hit spikes or a wall. Same for the other directions. Um, there is some uh, stuff you can do to make you go faster, um, which I will show you whenever I do it. But basically, we are in a factory and we are trying to escape this factory. And that's uh, where the story ends, basically. <laughs> Um, Reveting stuff. So we're gonna try to not die. And these green things are the portals. There, a uh, little strat there is um, as soon as you bounce to a wall, you can bounce down like this as well. And um, then you actually buffer the the bounce that you normally get by uh, by bouncing downwards. Also, there is eight levels every time. And after the eight level, you want to press menu and go to the next level like that, because it's faster, because uh, you skip like a credit screen. Kind of nice. There is uh, one RNG part in the game that can actually screw you up a lot. Let's hope it won't. It's like three fourths into the game-ish. But yeah, this is any percent. So um, you see this timer counting down at the top. Um, you can increase that by getting these coins. Um, you don't really ever need to get extra ones other than like one or two levels. Otherwise you're good on any percent at least. Alright. Can you not stop before you hit a wall? Uh, yeah, exactly. If you bounce to the right, you go right, you cannot interrupt it. And yeah, you can press space as well to jump, but you only really do that for uh, these... Uh, how do you say it? These automatic movement, moving bands. Uh, conveyor belts. That's the, that's the word. And here I use space as well. At least. So if you drop down from too far, you get this little bounce. So sometimes it is better to actually charge downwards, and sometimes it's better to just drop. Okay, this is an eight level again. So I'm gonna press M after this. And that is the first boss right now. Do any new mechanics get introduced when you enter a new world? No, it's the same. It's literally just the same it's thing. It's the same for thing. Eight worlds long or it however. It just gets harder. Yeah. Okay. All right. So we want to be faster than this bullet. Good. Just gonna do some uh, safety bounces sometimes when a long drop happens. It's kind of hard to time it sometimes. All right, that's the boss, and we're gonna once again press M to get out of that and escape to. Uh, Skip these cutscenes. Before and after every buzz, there's a cutscene. Are there going to be any real bosses, or it's just def levels that are like slightly? Uh, more yeah, you have to you have to actually kill some bosses. Yeah. Okay. Okay. This one was just like yeah, chase. You don't actually get to kill them, but the next ones are all uh, you have to actually hit them. Okay. All right. So this so this um, these few levels will introduce water as well uh, in a bit. Also, those purple squares or portals. There's like extra levels. You can unlock by getting all the portal cubes. Uh, these long drop downs are kind of annoying because it's hard to time. If you miss time, you're you're uh, you're screwed, basically. Especially because this level is really long. So if I miss time this, okay, good. I didn't. Sick. He's green. You just want to like double tap to get through them the fastest way. Right. So what are the keys that you're missing? Is there just bonus stuff that you're not getting? Yeah. Exactly. Right. Is your PB deathless or...? Uh, three deaths, I think. Okay. Something around that. That was an uh, eight level again, so... Okay, there is the water. So the water, you have to actually do these bounces to go up the fastest way. Whenever you can boost up or charge up, at least. 
here as well. Like you have to hit the wall like this, and like that. And then it's actually better to bounce here and then back dash or the down dash, which is faster than going up the wall. Here it is. Water levels are so bad if you die, because they're so slow. Can you not just go straight up? No, nope, because there are spikes at the top. You see? Oh. Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> that would have been nice. So even if you go up like in the water and go out of the water, it just like changes how fast you're going? Yep. Immediately starts moving faster if you go out of the water. Yeah. All right, here we're just going to bounce right, so we get the key. And here, instead of bouncing up, we're just going to hit the wall, which is faster than uh, going upwards and then waiting until we drop down in the slow, uh, slow water. All right. Oh, yeah. Nice. That is why you don't down dash there. This has like a cycle, but it's incredibly easy to get. It's harder than uh, the 76 star category. Basically, if you do a level fast enough, you get a star. And some of them require you to get quite a lot of coins uh, to get that. And that level especially, to get the cycle I just did in 76 stars, is kind of difficult. But here, it's, it's really easy. All right. This is the eighth level again. So after this, we're hitting M again. And we're going to go into the second boss. Once again, charging downwards there. Is it an octopus? It is actually an octopus. Damn. How did you know that? I've got a big brain. Damn. Congrats. He's called Boctopus, <laughs> actually. <laughs> Name. Is that the guy on the right? Uh, yeah, actually. Okay. Spoilers. Yeah. Damn. There's no dragon, though. All right. So the dragon's just fake news? Yep. M again, and boss time. So we're hitting escape. Boss is pretty easy, though. Just gonna jump over this, and as soon as it hits it, we can hit him. And we're just gonna move upwards and chill out here. Have to hit him like three or four times. And boom, just chill out here again. Now he's gonna knock us off. And we're just gonna grab the key. Otherwise the the, the rightmost part of those bottom conveyor belts don't move or move the opposite direction. So you get the key to make it move the right direction again. One more hit. Boss dead. Here we go. Yeah. Yep. Now we move up again and press M. Easy as that. Thank you. Very clap worthy. Thank you. All right. You this is it. where the difficulty uh, steps up a little bit. Nice. And also the RNG boss after this. Amazing. He's called Tess. T-E-S-S. -S. Actually an asshole. This is a little skip here you can do. Instead of uh, using that platform that moves to the left and the right. And then here, depending on where you are, you want to either down dash or just wait. Here, you want to wait because you don't get the extra jump if you down dash. Here, of course, you want to down dash. See, like when I landed, I got that little bounce. Okay. Here, it's not really worth down dashing. Like, if you down dash, you get a bigger height on that little bounce back. So, you don't want to do that. Okay. Here, we're just going to spin around. I'm doing it it's like a little bit unintentional maybe not but it's the fastest way at least all right oops I don't think I put my uh, steam notifications off 
Oh yeah. So this is the screen you get if you fail and forget to press M. Which loses quite some time. It's alright. Yeah. At least like four or five seconds. Here if you're fast enough, you can get the key like this. Let me skip that part. You wanna jump as late as possible, so we only have to jump once there. Because jumping is way slower. Like that. Now I have to jump again. Okay. Alright. So does each place have like a theme or whatever? Like how the one had water, this one has portals and stuff? Yeah, pretty much. Damn. Jump too early. Alright. The host wants to say anything, by the way. It would be a good time. Sure, I can do. <laughs> so, we are raising money for the Dutch Cancer Society, which is a nationwide organization committed to fight cancer, while aiming for a more cure and higher quality of life for those already battling the disease. All of your donations will go to the Dutch Cancer Society. Yeehaw. Yeehaw. <laughs> Yeehaw, indeed. Hell yeah. Alright. Getting closer to that boss really RNG basically he can he can appear on um, six different spots three of them are at the top level and three of them are at the bottom level and it's literally RNG where he appears and if you hit him like twice uh, from that point whenever he appears at the top there is like no time to move to the other side so you basically just have to be lucky That's to be cool. at the right side Oh, that was close. I hate these drop downs. Okay, it's good. Now to press M again. Skip this. And there we go to the boss. All right. This is Tess. Yeah, on the left. I guess there is a dragon. I suppose. Oh, man. You lied. lied to us. I lied. I lied. All right, so after two hits, he will um, drop in like a lightning bolt or whatever, like that. And now we're just going to hope, because it's not really worth moving up when he appears up and we're down. So we're just going to hope he appears at the bottom three times in a row now. Okay, bad luck already. Would have probably died. Okay, two more hits. This is basically just RNG. Okay, we're lucky. One more hit. Don't die. Oh my god, no way. Damn. It's unfortunate. I thought he wouldn't hit me, but he did. The bastard hit me. Also, if you're really unlucky, you'll run out of time here. Hopefully that won't happen. Okay. Uh, no, nah, that's too risky. I'm not going for that. Fear down. Oh, okay, whatever. Try and move back. All right. I like down more. I don't know why, but he appears more down than other directions. Oh I'm boy. getting so unlucky. Oh my god. Sad luck. It's yeah. all skill, baby. Yeah, he can be a real bastard. Okay. All right, I want to move down. Time it. God damn it, Tess. Why do you have to do this? Truly a tragedy. It is. Yeah. Okay. okay. Alright. Three hits. But first he spawns a lava ball. Now, appear down, please. Oh, I'm... No way, oh. dude. Are you kidding me? Damn. Never been so sad in my life. No. Yeah, what the hell, man. Not going well. <laughs> uh. Can you not hit him on the cycles that he throws the lava ball? No, you can't. You instantly die at him. Okay, once again. Here we go. Fear down. 
pretty please. Out. Thank you. Two more. Is the pattern of the lava balls random or is it consistent? It's uh, random. Yeah. Makes it even more fun. Oh, okay, there we go. Hey, we did it. Thank God. <laughs> Damn. All right. Yeehaw. One more set of levels, which is like the hardest levels, gauntlets. Oh. There we go. All right. This game's got some poppin' tunes. It does, actually. It has good music. So what's this world's theme? Uh, I know. Everything? Yeah. Yeah. Is That's this everything. also the final world? or? Yeah, where? final yeah, world. Alright, okay, that makes sense. Then. Yeah. As you can see, we can't dash upwards. Spikes. has a nice cycle we can get it do the cycles always start the same way uh Maybe this this look. is the same yeah but not everything uh yeah pretty much everything is the same it's world cycles though, or like level cycles so if you mess up in one screen you know it will the cycle i don't, I don't know how you see it like it'll carry over yeah yeah, yeah yeah exactly yeah, right. yeah. It's not like the cycle starts when you enter the screen. It's not. That's the opposite of that. Okay, let's wait here. All right. level again so we're hitting M again after this there is one more set of levels and then it's the boss these are the hardest levels. well the hardest level in the game is called gauntlet X and that unlocks if you 100% the game it's a really hard level yeah. won't be seeing that in this one Is there a small amount of time for donations? Go ahead. Yep. Another marathon for a good cause? Thanks to the runners, staff, and volunteers. Bidding goes to the runner's choice, and that's five euros. Runner's Any preference? Choice. Mm. Should towards we figure it out name. after the run? Yeah, towards my name on All the right. messenger run. <laughs> cool, we'll do it. That's a good one. All right, I'll sort that out. <laughs> Exactly, gotta get your name out there. Yeah. All right, this one has a pretty cool trick as well. Oops, that, that exactly that. Is that it? Yeah, yeah that, that was, was, that was it. That, that was that, that was a trick. Uh, you can like, if you down dash, can uh, I, 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 I kind of screwed it up, but. Yeah. <laughs> American yeehaw. yeehaw. Also, 43k. Oh, 4.3k. Alright, so this is the first level that you actually have to take some extra coins. Otherwise, you don't really make it if you go, like, right to the finish. 
Like the first time I played the schedule, I was like, wait, why am I like dying all the time? And then I realized there was a timer that was counting downwards and that if you would collect coins, it would increase them. It's the first level I realized that in, so kind of proves how you don't wait. really need to get any. So did you play this casually or? Yeah. Yeah, so that was just the first time you ever needed to do it casually, even. That was, yeah, that was the first time I realized you needed to get extra coins to get the timer up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. Like this part right here, this you wouldn't make that if you don't get any extra coins. And I was like, wait, why am I just instantly dying? I don't get it. it took me like so long to figure it out. Dang. All right. This one you have to make sure you bound or like you dash in the right direction. So you sometimes have to like go up here and then dash to the left on the next one. Dash to the left and then to the bottom. There you go. Nice. I agree. Definitely. There we go. Jump over this one. You can. Oh. There's another checkpoint here. The checkpoints actually got added later because a lot of people were complaining about no checkpoints. Babies. Yeah. Not agree. real gamers. Yeah. Fake gamers. Agree. This level is kind of long though, so I can understand why they would want it. All right. Now a giant spinning thing will chase us. You just out yourself as a fake gamer, buddy. <laughs> This drop is kind of annoying. Just gonna take it easy. Okay. There we go. Oh. What am I doing? <laughs> Memeing around. Okay, there is a portal here, so. Checkpoint. A few more, and it's the final boss. Though the final the, the level before the boss is actually really cool in how optimized it is. Also, if you spam hard enough, you have to you have a way easier time there. Okay, there we go. This key unlocks a door all the way back, by the way. If you were wondering why there was a key like at the end. If you get that key, you need to like backtrack all the way. Because there is like also like secret uh, secrets in the game. So Green is that what keys. You to get like the one hundred percent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To get the extra yeah. Alright, so this is the second last level before the boss. If I remember correctly. Apart from Tess, it's not that bad, at least. Wait here a bit. All right. So we go up first while breaking the right thing. And then, then we have to actually be really quick on all of these to make a cycle. Have to optimize here, and then we can barely make this. And if we're really fast, we can make that. Yay. All right. So like... No, okay. If you want to clap for that, sure. <laughs> Okay, the level is not done yet, though. We can make this cycle as well. Okay, good. Perfect. So if you had died in like an earlier segment, that cycle would have been off then? Yep, yep. Okay. Or if I would have been slow in an earlier second, yeah. Okay, let's... Down dash. Okay, kind of jump over this one. All right. Now we just need to get up. And it's the final boss. Name is Chip. And you can do that fight pretty cool as well. All right, that's it. Press M again to skip the credits. Does the secret level also have a boss? Uh, no, it's no. just a set of really hard platforms. Oops.
this is one giant cycle as well, so I need to play optimized everywhere to catch all the cycles I want. Also, time maybe is coming up if I don't screw up. <laughs> like in a minute or minute and a half-ish. This is kind of a tough one. Tough boss. Oh, okay. Didn't get hit by that one. That's good. Can I still make this? Yes. Alright, let's just play it safe now. Wait for that. And hit. Okay. We passed the hardest part. Yeah. Yeah. Gonna get some extra coins there. Alrighty. Last part is up soon. Overestimate hype. I believe. Alright. Gotta hit him a couple more times. All because of Tess, man. Alright. One more hit. There we go. Time is coming up soon. He's gonna die here. And the door is gonna open to the right side. And then as soon as I enter the green portal, it's time. Okay. And... Or purple portal. Time. There we go. Yeehaw. Hey. Yeehaw. Right. <laughs> Underestimate, baby. Was I? No. Yeah. Your estimate's 27 minutes, buddy. Oh, okay. I, t I thought I put it on 25. So, yeah, this is uh, the amazing story. Now we actually get to move out of the factory. And, uh, yeah. Let's see? You can also skip this, but might as well show it. You got it's really short. seconds, buddy. Yeah, it's fine. We got this. Look, he's happy. Thumbs up. Oh. And we get, like, a lot of portals that open now. And then the final cutscene. Hey, he's free. Right now. Hey, there we go. So this was Blitzbreaker any percent. Uh, thank you for Milk and Marlex to join me on the commentary. Yeah. There goes Totodile. Thanks for having me. Sad. Have fun with the rest of the marathon. Yeah, make me. That was Blitzbreaker by Exterior. Uh, and uh, next up is, <laughs> sorry, next up is Blossom Tales, The Sleeping King. Uh, and here's some ads, three minutes.